Hello, I'm Steve. Welcome to Johansson Family Vlog. Um, on the order of business for today is to try and get some more um, solar panels set up. So I've got to extend my solar panel array, um, the, the stand I built to hold those. And then I need to um, add the four solar panels I purchased to it. I have, um, I'm in the process of getting more batteries or new batteries that will be lithium for in the cabin and be safe so I can get the lead acid batteries out of there. Um, and to, in order to make all that work, I've got some new um, solar panels and a new charger to run down to those new batteries um, to charge them up. And so um, today I'm going to try and get a hole dug in the ground with a post hole digger to put another post in to extend um, the solar ray panel up there on the hill. So let's get to it. Okay, so I've got the post hole digger on the back of the tractor and I think I've got it all set here where I want it um, just to continue on with another section of the of the solar panel so I'll set the camera up and see if we can dig through this. All right, so there's my hole. That's plenty deep enough to get another one of those in. And um, nice and round. Should fill back in pretty good.
Okay, so I got the other section of the stand put up. Um, obviously, I still have to put the solar panels on. It's actually starting to snow pretty good. I don't know if you can see that too much there in the camera, but it's starting to snow pretty good and the light's starting to fail. So I think I will um, go ahead and finish this up tomorrow and um, I'll see you then. Um, today I'm going to try and get the solar panels um, gathered together. I've got one up on top of the roof um, on the other side there and um, I got to get that down and put some plugs on it, some connectors, and then um, we got to get all four of them up there on the stand and get them connected together. And then we'll need to run the wire down along the edge of the property and up to the back of the cabin. Um, and then we'll need to install the new um, charge controller. So that's what...
Okay, so up here in the bedroom now, um, I've brought up the, can't see them, but the solar wires come up right here. Um, no, let's just stay up here. Okay, so I've got the solar wires coming up from outside um, under the ground there, and they go into the bottom of the controller, and then i got wires to the battery coming to the controller, and um, I'll see if I can get this lit up here. Can we, can we see it at all? There we go, maybe. Okay, so we can see that we're pulling 200 watts right now, which is a 400 watts of panels up there, which I think that's about right right now because they're it's not it's kind of a hazy day, um, but you can see it pulling almost 80 volts. It's, so what's happening is the the um, the tracker is you know this is an MPT solar tracker right, so it's it's tracking it and it's realizing that it's going to get the most current the higher the voltage is because there's going to be less reduction or less voltage lost through the cables as I brought them down here. So um, we're pushing, you know, 15 amps right now. We'll keep an eye on it, see if we ever get all the way up to, you know, the 320, 340 that we should probably get out of 400 watts. So we'll see. But for now, that's that.